Hey guys, Amy with you, and I don't usually do end of year wrap ups, but this year felt like it deserved one. So quick look back at 2016 today on Vintage Space. So really, I wanted to do a bit of a wrap up of the year because this was the year that I hit a major goal that I'd set for myself, which was 100,000 subscribers. And I know a lot of you guys have been asking, yes, once I get the silver play button, I will do an unboxing video, but I wanted to take this time at the end of the year to thank each and every one of you guys who have subscribed to me, whether you're a new subscriber recent or whether you've been with me since the beginning when I was doing horribly irregular videos with a webcam. Um, thank you all of you for leaving leaving me all of your comments and your suggestions for videos and, and being engaged with the discussion around old timey space stuff um, because it's super fun and it's you guys that have let me do what I do for a living, that you've let me be a professional space history nerd, which is what I really need to have printed on my next business cards. Um, so thank you for making this year the first like amazing, awesome, super exciting year I've had with Vintage Space. And that being said, I have some really exciting things I'm looking forward to doing next year. I wish I could say that I was gonna be doing all kinds of travel to take you guys to museums and doing interviews and stuff, but I just don't have that kind of time or uh, means right now so maybe maybe 2018 but I do have some slightly different formats coming um, one thing I've been wanting to do for ages is actually vintage space movie reviews um, not of random movies of vintage space movies like the really really bad B movies from the 50s and 60s that uh, popped up with the sort of explosion of space exploration and all that stuff in the late 50s and 60s because they're they're so amazingly cheesy and bad so I'm looking forward to those so if you have favorite old-timey space movie titles that you love, leave them below because I'm looking to actually build out like a huge collection of bad B movie, B sci-fi movies from the 50s and 60s. Another thing I am super excited about is uh, the Vintage Space podcast, which I had a massive brainwave about uh, talking to my friends Brian and Anita. Um, it's gonna get good. I actually like figured out how to do it and it's gonna be starting in January just so that I can try to track its progress throughout a year, a calendar year to help me think. But um, we're looking at a serialized podcast, which is gonna be interesting for something uh, uh, that has I've never done anything serialized before so it's gonna be fun and I hope you guys really enjoy it and again it'll be uh, all the links and all these things will be available as they go along um, but perhaps my most exciting venture is a totally other venture and that is I am starting a second YouTube channel. Yeah! I have been wanting to do this for ages because you guys ask me a lot of questions about things that aren't necessarily in line with vintage space, about like what it's like to live online as vintage space, being one of the few women in a very male-dominated field. And I think it's time I start answering those questions, but I don't think they have a place on vintage space. So those kinds of things are gonna be on my brand new channel, just called Amy Shira Title. And you will also notice that the production value is not the same, not nearly as good, and that is by design. I wanted to keep this much more natural, much more off the cuff. So if you want to know what life is like when you live largely online, definitely check out my brand new channel. It's launching in January. So all that being said, I promise you guys, Vintage Space will not change. Vintage Space is my internet baby where I get to engage in all the things that make me super excited, like nerd excited, and that's not gonna go away. And I wanted to separate the two channels because I don't think that everything on the other channel will be of interest to everyone who wants Vintage Space and vice versa. Um, so if you are interested in getting a little bit more information of what it's like to live on the internet and kind of be the girl in the boys club a lot of times, uh, come check out my channel it's gonna be um, it's gonna be different for sure but it's gonna still be still be space nerdy because I can't not um, I'm still sitting in front of a wall of astronaut autographs so there's nerdery stuff but if you're not into that then you're not into that and just stick around for weekly space history videos because I do have a massive list of topics up on my wall right here that I can't wait to dig into um, and those will be coming up so regular vintage space content podcast the blog which I'm happily just host self hosting for now and putting more effort into the the YouTube stuff um, all that coming up next year I'm super excited for for a lot of the things that I have going on and I really hope you guys enjoy it as well so thank you guys again for making 2016 such an amazing year for vintage space and I cannot wait to start sharing all the awesome stuff I have planned with you guys in 2017